How's it going, ladies and bruises? I'm Bobby Sixkin, and welcome to World End Club, finally. Um, been very excited about this one, especially considering it is fronted by uh, Uchi Koshi, Kodaka, and Nakazawa, the trifecta of story writing goodness. Um, I am worried about what people have been saying about it, so I'm not too sure. But uh, hoping for the best, hoping for the best, hoping for a good experience. And it's the second game we've actually played on Switch, on the channel. Usually it's just PC stuff, so that's interesting as well. Let's jump in, shall we? Finally. Finally get into it. I know I'm two weeks late on recording this, but uh, apologies. It's not easy to get around here. Um, normal? I always go normal. <laughs> Why did default to easy though? That seems weird. Howdy. Nice to meet you. I'm Pylerp? Pylerp? Welcome to World's End Club. Huh? This isn't the first time we've met, right? Have you been here before? No. Of course, my bad, I must have imagined it. Anyway, this super fun game's just about to begin. Pi Loon. <laughs> Pi Loon. Oh, I'm It's definitely got, um... Kodaka's traditional art style, you know? I wonder if the others are doing okay. Yeah, we split up with them back there. No prob! Those guys know how to handle themselves! Anyway, let's just go! The enemy Mike is up ahead. Rachel, I'm counting on you! I suppose we should do the tutorial. Maybe I'll uh, skip ahead after the till after the tutorial. I'll bring you back once we're done with this shit. Hey, it's the others. <sighs> Are you all okay? Sure. What did you expect? <sighs> we're not gonna give up here. Where's Mike? I think beyond that door. It's finally time! Yes, the final battle. Everyone ready? Yeah. I'm ready whenever! Oh, it's a uh, start at the end and then skip back to the beginning thing. I'm ready for that. Holy shit. <laughs> Impressive. To come this far unbreaking? I must say it's a miracle. Holy shit. <laughs> but you can't go beyond this point. Unless you defeat me, you won't be able to see now. I guess we'll have to force our way in. <laughs> I wouldn't try to find it by me. There's no way you can beat me the way you are now. What did you say? You made the wrong choice. If you had gone down the right path, history would have changed. What do you mean? Okay. Hmm. What you want to do? Like the true ending path, right? But there's no point in even telling me. Because your history is about to end. Right here and right now! Shut your trap! We'll see about that! If we all work together, the Go Getters Club can do anything! Come on, everyone! Let's do this! I feel like this is gonna go badly. <laughs> Yeah, they went pretty badly. <laughs> this got fucking disintegrated. <laughs> and so ends the short but thrilling saga of the Go-Getters Club. But why did it happen like this? Because of the choices you make along the way. That answer lies in the past. Oh, 
What the hell? Full monochrome, are we? Are rules. First of all, you're about to play a game of tasks. A g game of tasks? Direct your attention to your wristbands. There's something <gasps> cool. We got wristbands too. <laughs> but this, this isn't my name. How observant of you. That is the essence of this game. What's displayed on your wristband is for someone else. Someone else's task. Only the first person to finish their task will receive a reward. Let's say person A finishes their task before anyone else. <laughs> then only person A will get a reward. However, None of you know your own task, right? That's why, to get the reward, you have to get whoever has your task to show it to you. Or even take it by force. Even if that means someone gets hurt. What a weird show. <laughs> 1995. Retro. <laughs> I guess I would have been about that old in 1995. <laughs> There's a lot to take in at the moment. <laughs> There's a lot to take in. There's a lot happening. I've seen some elements of uh, Zero Escape, a lot of elements of uh, Danganronpa. Where am I? So is this the main character? Is there a main character? And we're in an underwater facility, just like Ever 17. <laughs> Apparently. World Endland, 1994. Obtained a flyer for the Undersea theme park. Collection. Let's see. Okay, cool. Alright, alright. <laughs> There's the elements taken from pretty much every other game they've ever made. <laughs> Probably, uh, not. Hey, Rachel, just calm down. I'm the leader here, and I got it under control. Just do like I say, and I promise you, everything will be okay. We were on our field trip to Kamakura. On that bus. Then a meteor fell from the sky. I don't remember anything after that. I wonder if the shockwave from the meteor strike somehow sent us flying. Back in time? <laughs> it's a flyer for World's End Land. 
this undersea theme park. The grand opening was supposed to be last year, but it was canceled. I heard they just abandoned the whole thing for some reason. I don't know who, but I'd say we've been taken by some seriously dangerous people. We'd be smart not to get them mad. We should just do whatever they say. Seriously, what the hell is this? What the hell are we doing here? Rachel, are you behind all of this? Yes, we're behind all of this. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh no, we're done for! We've been kidnapped by some kind of crazy psycho! Probably. Oh, they're gonna eat us or something! Mm. Pochi, are you seriously playing your game right now? Yeah, it helps keep me thinking more clearly. Hey, everyone seems a little different somehow. Your spiritual waves. Everyone's aura seems to be really dark. I hope we're going to be okay. Whoa, Rachel, are you okay? What are we gonna do now? We've like totally gotta get out of here. Like totally. Listen, everyone. We can't just sit around here. We need to get above ground. Forget that. You can't get above ground. You're all trapped in this underwater theme park. Thanks, Monokuma too. We saw you in that movie, on the bus. Yellow Luke! That's right! So glad you remembered me! The name's Pielope. Hang on tight, cause you're all going to play a little game of fate for me! Game of fate? A game for your very lives. The rules are simple. It's all right here in the rule book. Go ahead and read it for me. Do I have to? The devices on your arms, they're called wristbands. On the wristbands are tasks or missions that you have to do. But those aren't your own tasks. They're other people's tasks. And the person wearing a wristband with your task is called your task mate. The first person to complete their task is the sole winner. The winner will be rewarded with a magic key. The time limit is one hour. No. Oh. If there's no winner when time is up, everyone loses. Task game? That's just like the movie, too. <laughs> Some of you airheads can't remember anything. So I made the rules nice and clear for you. Well, pretty easy, right? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> What's a magic key? It says here that that's what the winner gets. It's a key that can open anything with a keyhole. Like a master key. Anything? Of course. It could even open the door to the surface. Okay. Why do we have to fight everything? Like I said. You're all trapped in this underwater theme park. Without that key, none of you can get out. One thing though, the key can only be used once. So better make sure you don't waste it on the door to the bathroom or something. The first thing you all need to figure out is what your task is. Unless you know that, you've got no way of winning this game. So somehow, you've got to find a way to see the wristbands that show your task. Okay. Vanilla's task. Eat a marshmallow. But anyone who wins the key will use the key to open the door to get out. So why don't we just say, this is your task, do it, and now let's leave. <laughs> However you want to get that done, it's up to you. 
You can take a peek at your taskmate's wristband, or try to make a deal with them. But the easiest way would be to find your taskmate and get rid of them, don't you think? I don't see any reason why anyway, they would want to share. Enough talk. We better get this thing started. Well, actually, it already has started. See? You've already used up three minutes. So, better get a move on. Hey, hang on, you! What makes you think we'll play? Yeah. We're not playing some game of fate. Oh, you'll play. You'll definitely play. Because if you lose... The fuck? <laughs> Creepy. Designed to punish the losers, my little sludge bot. No, no way. Now you see, there's only two paths for you to follow. You either win the game, or you get processed by the sludge bot. Processed. <sighs> <laughs> Bye. She's not bluffing, is she? Nope. It's every man for himself. Self-defense is all about who strikes first. Rachel, I think we better do what that Pielope says. Yeah, not much choice. B well, if you all feel that way, same for me! Rachel, I know how you feel, but we really don't have a choice. Totally. Like, I don't want to do it either, but... <laughs> Yippee! This is awesome! Everybody's on board! I don't think Rachel's I'm on board. so excited! Cool then. Let's make this a nice, juicy, splatterific fake game no one will forget! Yellow Lily! Bye. <laughs> hey, so who's my task mate? Does anyone know what Chuko's task is? What's the point of even asking? No one here is stupid enough to tell the truth. Yeah, and what about Mochan? What should we do about him? If Mochan got a look at his task mate's wristband, then <sighs> that weasel. <gasps> He didn't, did he? He just freaked out and ran away. He's just a scared. Come on. They're all so dumb. In this game, info is what it's all about. And they don't have a clue. Hey, Rachel. I got a good plan. How about we team up? Only one person can win this game. But, Pielope never said we can't work together. Listen, I'm counting on you. You and me will work together until it's just us two. After that, you can win and get the magic key. You don't have to worry about me. That creepy robot, that sludge bot, isn't gonna get its stinking paws on me. Hurry up and get over here. Fine. We'll show each other our <laughs> wristbands to seal the deal, okay? Game of Fate has been unlocked. Okay. What does that do exactly? Oh, I see. It tells what task we have on our band. And what task... Okay, that's interesting. That's interesting. That's the spirit. Hey, 
I just said that info is what it's all about in this game, right? The thing is... The only one who's gonna get the info now is me. No! Man, you're gullible. You shouldn't be so trusted. I couldn't help it, your name's Anarchy. Like older brother. Come on. I thought you were smart. <laughs> it's why I wanted to take you out first. But it looks like I had you all wrong. <laughs> well, game over. Good episode, good episode. What's the deal? Hurry up! Yeah, we show back our here wristbands again. as a sign. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess I'm leaving. Damn. He's too smart. Or I've been there before. I gotta take him out before he becomes a problem. <laughs> that was brutal, man. Yo, Mochan! So you got no idea what your task is, huh? N no, I don't! How would I know that? In that case, let me see that wristband of yours! What do you mean, in that case? I don't see the connection! <laughs> Everyone, listen to me. I have a proposal. Proposal? Let's just not do it, okay? This game of fate. What do you mean? You know I'm the daughter of a scientist, right? No. So I looked at it logically and realized... Competing against each other isn't to our advantage. <sighs> We're suspicious of each other because we don't know each other's tasks. So in that case, we should all just be open and show our wristbands. Show our wristbands? Tatsun, you know me, right? Huh? Me? We're friends, right? And friends should trust each other. Y yeah but... Then let's start by showing each other our wristbands. But but Don't worry. We'll show at the same time. That would be fair. Right? Uh-huh. Okay. All right then. One, two... Hey, on your wristband, that's my task. It says... Don't show your wristband until six minutes before the time limit. But that means... He just lost. <laughs> Whoa, that girl's a bitch. <laughs> Everyone here is so deceptive. <laughs> I'm surprised well, how quickly... Usually in in these um, death games or whatever, they're not so quick to jump in and just start murdering each, each other. This, we're like 20 minutes in and they are all over murdering each other. They're like, the lady, the, the monokuma of the game comes and says, dude, you're going to have to kill each other. And they're like, okay, <laughs> give me a fucking knife. Let's start killing. <laughs> Usually there's a little bit of resistance, you know. It's very weird. <laughs> Yikes! You're really super sneaky! And skinny little four eyes, Tatsun is officially out of the game! Officially out? Didn't you hear what Tatsun just said? Tatsun's task was don't show your wristband until six minutes before the time limit. But he showed it to Nioro, so. Yep. C'est la vie. Nyoro knew that. So that's why she made him show it. So what happened to Tatsun? He got tossed into that robot. <laughs> He's probably just a thick, pasty sludge now. Bye-bye now. That's the end of my explanation. Piano Loon! Well, I say we beat the shit out of this lady. She's obviously Nyoro. evil. What's the deal with you? <laughs> You've got some kind of complaint? The normal Nyoro would never have done that. What do you expect? This isn't exactly a normal situation. Nyoro. Listen up! Everybody! I got Rachel's task on my wristband. 
Rachel's task is to touch someone on the back. Huh? Anaki? Why would you... I need everybody's help. That's why I'm sharing what I know. Touch someone on the back? What kind of lame task is that? That's too easy. He could win this whole thing in a flash. By accident. Yeah. True. How about we all work together so we can take out Rachel? Only one person can win this game. If Rachel touches anyone's back, we'll all lose. Yeah. And we'll get dumped in that robot. No, not that! Anything but that! Yeah, so to stop that, we gotta take out Rachel first. Everybody ready? Yup. Give it up, Rachel! Don't let him escape! They're so quick to turn on each other. That's crazy, that man. Well, I'll just let them take each other out for me. I'm just going to assume that they're terrible. They're all terrible people. <laughs> that makes it make more a little bit more sense. Yeah, let's go with that. Am I running away now? <laughs> can't get away, Rachel! Watch me, asshole. Go, go, go! <laughs> Pedal the dolphin cycle. <laughs> Pedal the dolphin cycle. <laughs> Push the button, stupid. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> I got your corner. It's over for you. Give it up, Rachel. Never, you asshole. <laughs> well, this looks like it's going to go badly. Damn it. <laughs> Take that. You got ratified. <laughs> you serious? Man, jumping really gets you ahead down here. <laughs> Ooh, what is this? I'll take it. Brief thief. Stick a book. I do like sticker books. Oh, what do we got? You may be able to find stickers hidden in certain locations in different stages. Visiting specific locations and meeting certain requirements will reveal the hidden stickers. There are two types of stickers, normal and rare. Try to find them all. I shall. What are we doing? Do we pick a location? Or are we just looking at our map? Just looking at the map. Are we still fleeing? Has he still not given up? Hello. Don't worry. I'm not going to attack you, Rachel. You seem like a nice person. Oh, Pochi. Vanilla. Pochi came from that way? Yeah. The outer hallways are shaped like a big donut. Are you serious? You're still playing your dumb old game? <laughs> Still managed to figure that out while this playing calms his game. Me down. By the way, I have a favor to ask Rachel. Can you come here? Oh god, no. Last time I did that, I got punched in the face. <laughs> okay, go ahead. <gasps> Just as I expected. What's the deal? It was a lie. Oh, I get it. That means Rachel's task wasn't to touch someone on the back. Of course not. My big bro was lying. How dare he? Even if he is my real brother. In fact, 
It's because he is my real brother that I'm so mad. It's a but good reason. Maybe it's not his fault. Like the others, he didn't seem to be his normal self. Now that I think of it, everyone was acting a bit weird. Maybe something strange happened inside those pods. Something strange? You know, like brainwashing or something like that. Brainwashing? But what for? To force us to participate in this game of fate, of course! Then why didn't they brainwash us? Us three. Anyway, it seems like the three of us here are still thinking logically. So that means there's only one thing for us to do. Kick the crap out of everyone else. <laughs> we should work together to win the game of fate. What? So to do that, we should show each other our wristbands. Wait just a second! You're kidding me, right? No. And you haven't been brainwashed? I'm totally fine. <sighs> Come on, Vanilla. Show me your wristband. You think I'm gonna say sure? Just like that? Tatsun just showed his wristband, and he... Here you go. Aniki's task. Eliminate everyone besides yourself? Jesus. <laughs> this is Tatsun's wristband. I picked it up after he dropped it a minute ago. I guess something makes the wristband come off once the person is eliminated. Concise task. Don't bleed until seven minutes before the time limit. Does everybody has to bleed seven minutes before the time limit? See? Do you get it now? You won't end up like Tatsun if you show us your wristband. But... Rachel still hasn't shown us what his wristband says. W what do you mean? You're not going to show us? Vanilla's task, eat a marshmallow. I can't show them this. I see. So no negotiations, huh? What? That's not fair, Vanilla. Why? You were the one that showed it to me. Ugh. I'm sorry. It's not that I don't trust you two, but I can't show you my wristband no matter what. Anyway, good luck, you guys. <laughs> See ya! See ya. Vanilla. Well, that's it. There goes my strategy. It didn't seem like Vanilla had been brainwashed, so I thought she'd show her wristband. Well, it is what it is, I guess. Only one thing to do now. Keep everyone from doing their tasks. Sure, especially Araki. <laughs> whose Rachel, task is to murder everybody. I something over here. Let's keep on poking around. I like all the weird shit hanging from the ceiling. The giant squid. The, the... the giant squid hanging from the ceiling is very cool. Exit. So this must be the and way And the out. divers. Diving suits. But we need a key to open it. But I bet the magic key would work. You think? Oh, investigate. This door won't budge. Lame. Maybe if we entered a password in the panel. Nothing happened. I don't know what the password is. I imagine that's the problem. You'd be in trouble if I got eliminated, right? So you better help me for your own good. Or do you want to end up like Tatsune? <sighs> Fine. I'll help. I knew you're a smart one, Yoro. Oh, Rachel's here! And Pochi too! Two boys against two girls? This isn't good. And if Rachel touches either of us on the back, we're done. We'd better get out of here. Yeah, let's go. Should we keep them thinking that that's our task? So those two teamed up, huh? We better be careful. I guess it's good for them to think that because then it would be very easy for us to win. So they are scared of us. Something <laughs> odd about this door. Keeps them away from us, if nothing else. 
It won't open. Yeah, it doesn't There's look no like keyhole, the... but it has an input panel with numbers. I wonder what the passcode is. I have no idea. Yet we have much exploring to do. I wonder how long a run takes. Hey. Back to where we started. Jeez, this place is quite small, Makes huh? Makes sense. Shaped like a donut, yeah, you said that. And this is back at yeah. the start. We can see the ocean view by looking through the pipe. That creep, it put it it put us in the sleep thing. Oh hello. Another sticker? I do like stickers. <laughs> Reed Electro Reed Ranger. Cool. Yeah. This whale is a creepy pattern, it does. Hey. It looks like Sin or something from Final Fantasy X. Yeah. Whales and squids are technically the same species? Y yeah. Really? Mm. Here are the pods we were sleeping in. Are you sure about that? <laughs> Is there anything else to see around here? I'm not allowed to leave. This one's still closed. Why? Can we go now? Those whales are crazy looking. I'm very like it. I feel like it might be able to shoot magic out of its nose or something. That'd be pretty cool. <laughs> Keep moving. I guess we're going round and round and round, right? Wait! I'm not gonna let you do it! That sounds like Kansai. Let's go! Sure. Sounds like he's having a really good time over here. I guess he came back after he gave up on chasing us. Because he's just too damn slow mm. for us. <sighs> These are fun. I like it. <laughs> you serious? Investigate. Looks like this drawbridge can be raised and lowered by prep. Yeah, I see that. What are you two doing? I told you to let go! I'm almost there! Why would I let go? Rachel! Oh no! He's gonna touch our backs! No, Kansai. <laughs> Aniki was just making that up. Like I'd believe that. Anyway, I got bigger problems. This is what happens to anyone in my way. Sh shut up. We gotta hurry. Wh what's going on? M Mo Chan. He saw my wristband. Mo Chan's task is on my wristband. What's his task? Ah. Uh... No use hiding it now! Ride the Ferris wheel one time in the red gondola. That's Mochan's task! I see, that's easy enough. Well, the red one's gonna take a while to come back down. That's why I need to destroy the Ferris wheel's power system! Ugh. Cut it out! Don't worry, I will! Once the red gondola gets here! We're done for if Mochan gets on the Ferris wheel! We got no choice! Pochi! Rachel! Destroy the Ferris wheel's power system for me! Okay. <laughs> Why the fuck not? I do love destroying things. That way, Mochan won't be able to do his task, and he'll be eliminated! Stop it! I don't want to die! There are so many things I still want to eat! Hurry! Before the red gondola gets here! We can't let Mochan finish his task. Come on, 
Let's break the power system. Okay. But doesn't that mean he's gonna die immediately? Just like what happened to Tutson? That means we'll be responsible for his death. I don't like that. I don't want to feel like I'm responsible for his death. I guess we should destroy the power system. It's already fucking mostly destroyed. Look at the cable. But how do we do that? Hey. Can we fill it up with water? What the? Ooh, puzzles. Actual puzzles. I'm very excited about that. Did I miss? Hmm. I totally missed. So you have to drop it down and then push it over. I see. I see. I mean, it's not much of a puzzle, but puzzles are puzzles. I do like puzzles. As you are all well aware. I fucking missed again. Oh no, it counted. It counted. It's fine. Now, now the fat kid's gonna die. And, and it's my fault. I'm a bad person. You could fix the Ferris wheel. Never mind. No! I don't want to die! It's my fault now. <sighs> that was close. No way. Ooh. What was that sound? What's in here? It doesn't look like we can open it from here. Ooh. Dude, I'm excited to try and like get through all these doors. There's so many doors around. Does it all loop back around on itself and that sort of thing? Is there a lot of secret rooms? Good. We made it in time. <sighs> Mochan has been eliminated. What what is it this time? That's Whoa, four people are gone? How did those two get gone? Hey ya! Enjoying the game? Yeah, it's alright. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna go ahead and give you some useful info. But if you're going to be rude, forget about it. What do you mean, useful info? Didn't I just tell you to forget about it since you were rude? I wouldn't tell you now. Even if you prized my mouth open, I won't tell you you can see the faces of the eliminated people right on the monitor. Oops. Uh, uh. Anyway, I guess I let it slip. I'm expecting a nice, lively battle. Don't let me down. Yellow Lagoon! So Chuko and Yoro have been eliminated. Now that Mochan is out, the truce ends here. Huh. But two versus one is bad news. Time for a quick retreat. At least we got this uh, band here. What does that band say? Now I'm getting in on the killing. Oh, so that's how it is. Chuko's task was protect the park's facilities until eight minutes before the time limit. That makes sense since we destroyed the ferris wheel just now. But ah. why was Nioro eliminated? Well, no point worrying about that now. Let's go, Recho. I'm sure we'll figure it out sooner or later. Are they going to change between runs? The tasks, or are they always the same? They seem arbitrary huh? anyway. No way. Now those two have teamed up together? Nyoro and Chuko teamed up? I didn't see that coming. This is the wristband that Chuko dropped. Let's see what it says. Hmm. Nyoro's yeah. task. Go down the slide with Chuko. Well, she can't do that because Chuko's gone, so she's out automatically. Chuko must have shown this to Nyoro and then threatened her. Something like, if I get taken out, 
you're a goner too. Because if Chuko got eliminated, she wouldn't be able to ride down the slide with her. So that meant if Chuko is gone, then Nyoro wouldn't have a chance either. That's how Chuko got Nyoro to help. Although she planned on betraying her later. Nyoro knew that Chuko would betray her, but she had no choice but to go along with it. So then they were going around together, but Chuko got eliminated. And then Nyoro couldn't complete her task. Oh, oh, I see. Amazing, Aniki. You saw through everything. You don't have to be a genius to figure that out, do you? Come on. Do you have a sixth sense like I do? <laughs> no, he has a brain. <laughs> no. And even if I did, nobody can see through everything. Well, true, but... I was the one that gave Chuko the idea. That's how I know. I guess for Nero, Chuko is also in the way. So she died early. Damn you, Aniki. Well, that's that. Time for plan B. Right. Let's go. What does he mean by plan B? I hate to think. He's the Let's biggest follow. monster of them all. Alright, we need to wrap this up because I've been letting this go on for far too long because hey. I'm just trying to figure out what's going on here and everything. Or do we have to do a single run per... per episode? Looks like we might have to do it like that because... Uh, there's no saving between episodes by the look of it. <laughs> so maybe I have to do long episodes and cut them down? Wait. I don't really know. No, you know what? We'll cut one. We'll cut it here. Um, I'll record the next one straight after anyway, so that'll work. Um, and then we'll see where we're at next time. Interesting so far. Interesting. Um, I'm still... I guess the way, the reason that everybody jumped on board the killing train is because they've been brainwashed or whatever, but I hope for they elaborate on that a little bit later, but hope you guys enjoyed it, thanks for watching, thanks for taking it out with me and I'll see you in the next one.